this is recording from the Note 9. <clears throat> and this is what it is right here. The InstaFame 50 LED light works for all cameras and smartphones. So you can even turn this on, put this on your smartphone, which, which is pretty dope. It's kind of like a ring light. It's kind of like a ring what? Ring light. Ring light. Okay. So that's how it goes right there. As you can see. Oh, and they're called light diffusers. <clears throat> and then it gives you the suggestions. It gives you, you, you gotta mount it on the camera. All right, so the, the um, suggested, suggested things that this is meant to be used for is documentaries, movies, sports, theater, fashion, outdoor, travel, and you can read the rest. And it can be mounted on a DSLR, a mirrorless camera and a phone holder. So that's pretty cool. I think it screws in at the bottom. All right, so um, if that were to be mounted, if that that right there, I don't think it goes like that, but I guess you can use it like that. I guess you can use it like that because the camera um, opens, because the camera opens and closes. So I guess you can use it like that. That's pretty cool. Um, all right, but um, for my mount, obviously it has this hole right here and this hole right here. And obviously the hole right here, it would get mounted on the camera right there. So it's just multiple ways you could use it. You just turn it at the bottom, like the wheel to tighten it. And there it goes. So, um, is it recording? Mm -hmm. Huh? All right, so we're gonna show you, turn it off. All right, so unfortunately it's kind of early, so we'll try to give you the best we can for a dark view I'm going into the closet y'all <clears throat> I mean obviously it's gonna light up it's a light all right you're gonna have to close the door all right so this is the camera with the light setting off we didn't we didn't show you with it off so Give us a second. All right, so that's it with it off, as you see. Hold on, wait for my camera to zoom in. All right, there you go. So that's it with it off. It's really hard to to see. One second, because the camera's moving. All right, so that's it with it off. Now we're gonna show you how it looks with the camera on. I mean, with the light on. All right, bam. So it pretty much lightens up the whole entire um, the room. So now I'm gonna show you not some footage through the camera, but footage through my phone through the camera with the light. 
um it, i can't show you through here because the camera is going too fast but it's like really crystal clear um <clears throat> it's literally just a light so there you go hold on that's my camera focusing all right so as you see you probably can see like it's really really clear trust me it looks like 30 times better but that's it so it's a good light if you need any lighting and i paid 20 dollars for that so that's pretty cool oh, okay yep we're gonna show you the, the shades what what color are we doing first Alright, we're doing the orange shade first, so you just pop it on, and hold on, so that's with the orange shade on, um, as you see, it, it got it a little bit darker, so that's pretty cool, now let's look at the camera, alright, I'm zooming in, and as you see, it's giving it like an orange effect, which is pretty cool, maybe you could like make a movie with that type of picture or something, something of that nature. All right, so we're gonna go to the other color, which is blue, I believe. <clears throat> and I like the blue off the rip. I really like the blue. Um, so this is the view that you have with the blue showing. It's, it's a really, this is my camera doing this justice. So now we're gonna go to the camera. One second. Bam. All right, so I really like the blue. It's like a low light, but it's still light. And now we're gonna go to the last color, which is the white. Bam. And they just snap on. So the white is basically yeah, it's the same as um, not having a filter on. It's pretty cool. Um, but I do like the orange. This is it with with it on. I do like the orange and um, I do like the blue effect that it gives. That's pretty dope. Basically, I could just flip the screen around and that's really useful into recording so I can see what I'm doing and stuff of that nature. All right, and let me give you the price that I paid for everything. All right, so coming out the door, we ended up paying $8.56, which was a really good price. We paid $6.29 for the camera. We paid $50 for the, uh, what is it called, a tri tripod? Tripod stand. <clears throat> for the tripod stand. We paid $20 for the light, and we ended up paying $70 for the warranty. And thirty-four dollars for the SIM SD. SD card. So there it is. That's the review.